it's definitely something that I know me and my teammates are just gonna we're just gonna soak it in for right now. We're just, it's always gonna be something that we can have with us and it's, it's champions live forever. It's the same as last year. Every year is the same at Carmel. You, you have to reload and uh, the same mentality that I spoke about before with seniors stepping up has to remain true. Um, if you're good, you, you will be senior dominated. If you're good, you're gonna lose a lot of starters every year. And uh, every year that I've been here, you know, we've looked at that depth chart and we said, well, how are we going to replace a Jalen Duncan and a Brandon Denning and an Adam Kehoe and a Quinn Rusnak? And every year we end up finding kids that are willing to pay the price and, and put in the time and, and make the sacrifice uh, to lead that next year's team. So, you know, this year, this offseason, uh, if we do it like we've done it every year in the past that I've been here, uh, I think that we could have a successful year next year, too. When, when they walked to Carmel High School, through Carmel High School, or when they're at the Carmel High School football field and they see players like Brandon Denning and, and Sean Heffern, um, they just want to be a part of it. That's the thing that's, that's amazing about this program. When you're a third and fourth grader, you look up to those high school football players and they set the tone for the next several years. And it's just very exciting to be part of it. Go Hounds, and, and I feel like now that the underclassmen have a taste of it, they're going to want some more. I think more than anything, we were just a hardworking team. Uh, we were, we're, you know, we were a very selfless team. Every game there was a different player, you know, who had the biggest game of their life. Um, so I think we were really hardworking and just the unity and the camaraderie that, you know, we put out, we transferred to the field, you know, uh, really helped us win a lot of football games this year. Um, you know, winning a state championship is one of the best experiences I've ever had. Um, just a message to all the younger guys, you know, just take that in, you know, watch how the seniors acted. Um, throughout you know this playoff run and just learn from it. I'd like to say you know to the younger guys, keep working hard all season long. Um, and you know this this team this year was just so special. It was an honor to play for this community and with my teammates. You know I wouldn't play for any other team in the state. I guess if there's you know one last thing I would say is that uh, I'm as proud of this group as I, as I've ever been. Coaches and players and what you've been able to accomplish and the adversity you've overcome. I love you guys and and I know that you're going to take uh, these memories and, and and be successful for for the rest of your lives. I will never forget the 2011 Carmel Greyhounds. This was uh, a special team to coach.